And you can 100%, like, you'd be a fool not to listen to men who are successful and who you respect. You'd be a fool not to consider what they say seriously. But at the end, a man should make his own decision. And I don't think you're capable of doing that just now when you're like, it, like, you know, every day you're listening to these messages. It's if you imagine in the physical world, it's like having your mentors all stood all around you, like dragging you physically each way. Like, you know, Chris from First Man's telling you, yeah, come, let's go fuck those women. Tate saying, yeah, get my Bugatti. I'm there, like, bro, come on, let's meditate, man. Jack's like, ooh, like, you know what I mean? It's, it's fucking weird, bro. Like, I don't think that's healthy, man. <laughs> Why don't you just, <laughs> just go stand in nature, bro? <laughs> I think that's what you need, bro. <clears throat> I think you detach, you. Do the detachment first to figure out what your goals are. If your goal is to sleep with as many women as possible, then the red pill tactics that you've learned will help you do that amazingly. I can vouch for that. But if your goal is to find love and attract a good woman and to bring that into having a family, the exact way that you've learned to navigate your dating life the red pill will take that away from you. Those minor tactics, those those videos that I have made, take longer to reply, act busy, be unemotional, don't talk about yourself, don't you know, be mysterious, all these things. I realize now that was that was absolutely ten out of ten amazing advice if you want to fuck broken women. It is the fastest way possible. If you literally just care about that then you can do it. My issue now is like, that's obviously, that's a shallow life. And the idea like, oh, you're beautiful, oh, oh, I'm an alpha male, I've, you know, I'm like an animal, I've got testosterone, bro. It's like, if that's the case, if that's the real case that you're doing this for masculinity, you, I just want to fuck as many women as possible. Do it without a condom and get them all pregnant then. Do, do, the, do it properly. That's what I would say to you. If, if that's what you're going to say, right? If you want to, if anyone here wants to say like, oh, yeah, you know, like, oh, but I'm an alpha male, you know, it's my job to fuck. Okay. Try and get as many women as possible then. Don't use condoms. Don't pull out. Deal with the consequences. Cause that's, that's what the masculine urge is, right? Or if you want to be better than a fucking monkey and realize that we're a little bit more developed than animals and figure out like if this ends up being your goal, understand that then. Loving a woman is not the same as attracting a broken woman. A woman who's broken because of the culture she's been raised in, because her mother is a fe like pretty much a feminist. Her mother has kicked out the father from the home. The father's left. The, the, this woman's been raised by broken teachers in school. And then she listens to female rappers and or just music in general is all degenerate. Use those tactics on women like that. You'll be doing well but you will be destroying your soul. And if you do end up converting and trying to get a wife, you are disrespecting her because you are lower quality because you spent those months and years learning these things, these pickup artist things. You spent those late nights doing this whilst that dream woman of yours was staying in early and like <laughs> reading the Bible. And so she's going to be pissed off you. And the, the worst thing is actually, no, she's not going to be pissed off because she's got, she has to be lower quality. If you, the, the more degen women you fuck, then your your wife has to be lower quality. It's just it's just how it is, because you've just been distracted. But now, if it's, if it is what you said, and if fatherhood and deep relationships is the goal, you have to go through the, a similar transformation like I did, and unlearn a lot of the red pill things. Not all of it. Five to twenty percent is very very crucial, and I'll make sure that you don't ever become a chump in marriage like a lot of guys will you've got that advantage because you know the red pill things you know how big of me you'll need to learn effective communication blue pill stuff that seems very fruity it seems like <laughs> it seems like um it's, it's very hard for a red pill guy to to unwind this but effective communication if you start there and that's the that's like that's like a sword. You know, in video games, you have like the basic attack. That needs to be the basic attack now. And, it, and it's hard to do when you've been closing up.